Okay guys, how's it going? I just wanted to make a short video showing my latest two Oblivion characters. I figured I'd just let everybody know what I've been doing lately. Because I haven't put up a video in a while. So, yeah, I was playing Oblivion. And... Uh, these are my last two characters. Give me a second here. This one is Pug. He's a high elf. A wizard. I made him a Magi class. Uh, I'll show you that in a second. His main uh, items were intelligence and willpower, but I also made a number of rings to increase all those stats you see in the hundreds, like the strength, intelligence, willpower, speed, and endurance. Most of that was rings I uh, enchanted. wrong button but that's that's why his stats are so high 45 is the maximum level I could reach with him I don't know of any way to get uh, any higher so yeah and uh, he hasn't done any part of the main quests yet he completed the Mages Guild line. Yeah. I've got... Uh, what is it? I've got all of my main skills. Those are all the major uh, mad wizard skills with alchemy. So that's all seven of those. And then the rest of them I built up just running around. And a uh, few, well, a number of them I bought. The, uh, what was it? Blade, Blunt. I don't think I bought any hand-to-hand. -hand. I think I punched my way through that. Acrobatics. I got that up before I left. Uh, before I found the Emperor the second time. Before he died. That spot by that first goblin that you sneak up onto. It takes a few hours, but I built up that sneak and I built up a lot of restoration. I think I was in my uh, 40s when I uh, got out of that uh, sewer system. But, uh, yeah, and this guy I haven't had to worry about because I created a full set of invisible garments by doing chameleon on uh, everything. And then I got uh, I think I got one of those two thief type rings. Senior moment, can't remember the names of them. I might have uh, created a double of that one. Because I only see 
those fours. So, uh, add to the fix. Chameleon, 145. Grand Ring of Shadows and Ring of Kajiti. Yes, that's 65 points there. Detect life. You find a, a number of those rings that you can duplicate. All these others are from other rings. Ring of Treachery, Ring of Thieves, Ring of the Grave. Those were the ones I couldn't remember. <coughs> I'll tell you what, with him invisible, it makes the game so much easier, they don't even notice he's there. And I'm kind of halfway decent weapon. I've got uh, others in the tower. So every time I hit with this one, I get 15 points of health back. But I haven't had anything hit me throughout almost all of the game. But yeah, that's that's my mage. Give me a minute. I will load the other one. Logan half point. He's a Nord, and I uh, I think it's made him a warrior. I have to check. I know I took it straight off the list. I didn't make a custom class with him. But he doesn't have any chameleon items on. He's got all Daedric armor. And he's got... Uh, uh, Chillrand or something like that? Right, give me a second. Goldbrand. The one you get from uh, fighting the Ten Bloods challenge. Took me a while to get all of that Daedric armor. The gauntlets were the last piece I needed and that took forever. And then after I got up a little higher, I started getting the magic Daedric armor. That always helps. Sun Warrior made a warrior class. He actually made it up to level 46. I didn't actually uh, do up his magic because I wasn't worried about that. After all, I was making him a warrior. But I did his strength and endurance. The rest of that uh, like speed and willpower, that was rings or whatever. Yeah. One second. 
Yeah, those were all the classes and the skills for that uh, warrior class. These ones are just built up over time. I uh, used those two because I wanted to uh, get a couple of spells, especially Soul Trap. I wanted that one really low so I could make a bunch of black soul gems. With the restoration, uh, I've just been building up over time because every time I get hit, I cast a number of heal spells on myself. And it just keeps going up. Uh, I've been running around for a while. The acrobatics, I started building that up and then I was like, nah. I ain't worried about it. He's at, he's at about 50, so I just whenever I needed to jump, it, it's got him up to 58 so far. Mercantile, that took a while. And I'm not gonna lie. And the last part was the worst. Because I went to try and buy the master level uh, mercantile skills and the lady in the temple told me that I have to find every beggar and talk to him. That's a lot of beggars in this game. And heck, I don't know where half of them are. So that actually took a while to uh, build up. Oh wait, that was Speechcraft, I'm sorry. Mercantile was easy to build up. It must be later than I thought. I hit the wrong skin. I'm sorry. He hasn't joined the Fighter's Guild. The only reason he joined the Mage's Guild was so he'd get uh, spells from the different uh, branches. His fame is low because he hasn't really done a whole lot. You can see he's been out a while, 138 days passed. But yeah, those are the two characters. I even built up uh, his light armor skill on there. I figured, what the heck, I'd already built up the heavy armor. That goes quick. So I got him a set of glass armor and started going to the, the uh, mines with people in them. Just kept running with circuits. And uh, built up pretty quick. Plus, it helped build up the armor skill. It was fairly high, but it, it takes a while to build up. Um, let's see. Yeah, I never got to uh, 100 on Speechcraft. So. Well, I never got to buy the spells for that because I ran out of levels. That's what it was. 
when I went to sleep to gain another level, I couldn't um, go up anymore. So I'm stuck there for the moment. The moment. But it'll probably be a while since I, uh, until I played this game again. So I just wanted to give you an update. Later, guys.